Science, in this video, let's practice converting within the metric system. And what I've done, uh, we have King Henry died by drinking chocolate milk. Kilo, hecto, deca, base unit, deci, centi, milli. And the base units, or the B, I'll write base. In this particular example, we're using liters, will be meters, liters, and grams. Now remember, they are not the official SI units, but in this particular, they're acceptable base units. Meter, liters, and grams. So let's get started, okay? 5.8 kilograms equals how many grams? I always put a check where I'm starting at, and then an X where I am going, and I'm going to grams, and grams is a base. So I will put a X mark there. I then always go from check to X with my arrow, and that tells me which direction the decimal will be moving. Then I just count. One, two, three. So I'm going to add some zeros. So I go one, two, three. So that becomes 5,800 grams. 3.6 liters equal how many milliliters? Liters is one of my base units, so I would put a check there. And I'm going to milliliters, which is here. I'm going to put an X. I'm going from the check to the X always. So I just count one, two, three. I'm adding three decimal places. So I go one, two, three. So that becomes 3,600 milliliters. Now we have 0 0.05 meters equal how many cent? meters. Meters is a base, so I put a check where I'm starting. I'm going to centimeters, which is the C. I'm going from the check to the X, draw the arrow, and I count. One, two. The decimal is here. One, two. So that becomes 7.5. Now I'm at meters, 0 0.075 meters, same thing. And put a check where I'm starting, and this time I'm going to millimeters. Put an X. I go from check to X, okay, and I'm moving one, two, three times. So it's one, two, three. That looks like a 75 millimeters. Couple more. I have no idea why they why that grams is here. Let's convert that just to meters, okay? Makes no sense, but anyway, it was a typo. So we're going to meters. I start at millimeters. Let's put a check at millimeters, and I'm going to meters. So this time we're going opposite. I go from check to X always, okay, from start to finish, and I count one, two, three. So it will be one, two, three, which is point three five zero meters. Now let's work a couple more. Okay, hopefully you're beginning to get the handle of this. We have two kilometers equal how many meters? I put a check where I began, which is kilometers. Meters is one of my base units, so I will put it X. I go from the check to the X, tell me which direction I'm going. I will count one, two, three decimal places, so there's one, two, three, that looks like 2,000 meters. Now let's go from milliliters, put a check where I begin, and I'm going to liters, which is a base unit, put an X there, and I'm going in from the check to the X from start to finish, one, two, three, so I move it, one, two, three, so it is 0 0.350. Okay, next we have, it looks like a million milligrams, um, million, a million milligrams equals how many kilograms? Well, let's just convert it. We're going to start, check is where we begin. We're going to kilograms all the way over here. We're going from check to the X, okay? So I count one, two, three, four, five, six. So I just move one, two, three three, four, five, six, looks like one kilogram. And the last one, 
700 meters equals how many kilometers? Start at meters, which is a base. I'm going to kilometers. I go from the check to the X, that direction. I'm going to count one, two, three. So I go one, two, three. So it is 0 0.700, zero, or you could just write 0 0.7 kilometers. I hope that helps in converting. If you'd like to know more about converting, this playlist will help. And as always, thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.